The Hugh O'Brien Youth Leadership Conference, or HOBI, took place on the campus of Troy University, where over 300 high school juniors attended to learn about valuable leadership skills. HOBI is a youth leadership conference. HOBI stands for Hugh O'Brien Youth Leadership, and it's for rising juniors in high school. Um, these juniors have been selected by their counselors to come and participate in the conference, so each school has the opportunity to send representatives. Um, and so they come and they experience HOBI and they learn about leadership at their age and how they can make a difference regardless of how old they are. Students were nominated by their high schools and were chosen based on their leadership ability, the ability to work well with others, and a desire to learn. They learn about leadership. They learn not just what it means, but how you can lead in many different ways. They hear from people in many different types of leadership and community leadership in different roles throughout the ages. So you hear from people who are their age. You also hear from people who are much older and how what you do at the ages of 15, 16, 17, up to 20 and in college really affects you long term. And so how making good decisions now and being a good leader starts such a great foundation um, for your future. One student representing the state of Alabama will be selected to attend the Hobie World Leadership Congress in Washington, D.C. in late July. The way that we select them is we, we really kind of evaluate them. How are they handling, how are they really critically thinking through what they're learning this weekend? How are they really taking the steps to apply this to their life? And what are their thoughts on what they're learning? One student tells us that she is proud to have made it this far and hopes to build her leadership skills. I'm hoping to learn some leadership skills and make some connections for planning our annual color run this year and homecoming. Hobie was founded by actor Hugh O'Brien in 1958 and has been in the state of Alabama for 31 years. Samantha Cocan, Troy, Trojan Vision News.